Welcome to Q&A Tutorials. This short tutorial is about Weebly and will answer the question how do I add a Creative Commons license to my website? Hello everyone, I've had a question about how to add the Creative Commons logo and links to the bottom of a Weebly website like I did here on this example for Assignment 2. Yes, I'll show you how to do that. There is actually two ways. Um, the way I did it was to use the basic paragraph picture um, placeholder and I uploaded the little image, typed in the writing and added the links. But there is a simpler way to do that and that is to click on the more elements um, information here and you'll see that there's a custom HTML box. So just drag and drop that onto your page, which I've done here. and then go to the Creative Commons site. So I've got another tab open, which is already open at creativecommons.org.au. And to save time, I've already typed in some information. But if you click on this license link here, I'll just click forward so I get my information. It will take you to this license your work page, which has a series of questions that you just answer and put in your information and it will make a custom license especially for you with your information already in it and so when you've entered your information in your name and the um, link to your site click select a license you can see there's three different images to choose from and when you check, select which one you want um, this html code now don't worry about the html code looking a little bit complex you don't need to know what it says i'm just going to select that middle license icon and then come down and copy all of the HTML. Now I'm just using a keyboard shortcut on a PC, Control C, to copy that. So you can right click or do whatever to copy. And back into my Weebly editing mode, I click back into my box, make sure I'm in edit, and I'm pasting Control V, keyboard shortcut, or right click and paste. And that's all you need to do. You then have your little icon already inserted and the information and the link. Now you won't be able to click on that to link until you publish it. So you simply click on your publish button up the top and that will give you your actual link to your website. If you want to give someone the link, i.e. you want to put it in your um, assignment submission so I can get to it, just copy that link. And I'm going to click on it. And when we go down to the bottom of the page, you can see my original one is there, and then the new one, which is now hyperlinked and will take me directly through to the Creative Commons I selected. It already says that you must attribute me, and this is the link that they can copy and paste to put on their website to attribute the work to me. Okay, so that's a, a nice, easy way. More Q&A tutorials are available on Jenny P98's YouTube channel at www.youtube.com forward slash user forward slash Jenny P98.